Do you want to be a better leader? Most of you know that my ministry at Ignite Purpose revolves around encouraging better leadership. The reason I talk about practical time management, taking a Sabbath, and even like last week talking about exercise is to point people to better balanced lives. Better balanced lives will lead to better leadership and authentic influence at work and even more importantly, at home. I've been part of a team at Percival Baptist Church that has developed a leadership program called Leaders for Life. This study teaches the simple truth that leading entails influencing people to think, say, and behave in ways that take them from one place to another. Leading, in fact, can be formal, where you hold a position of authority, or informal, where you simply influence people but don't really hold a position of authority. But it's all too easy for a leader to get wrapped up in the what, when, and how of leadership and miss out on the relational aspect of those we lead. One thing that we have to accept is that we are all leaders and we need to focus on those relationships. Matthew 20, 25 through 28 says, Jesus called them together and said, You know that the rulers of the Gentiles lord it over them, and their high officials exercise authority over them. Not so with you. Instead, whoever wants to become great among you must be your servant, and whoever wants to be first must be your slave. Just as the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve, and to give his life as a ransom for many. So what do you do for this week? Are you ready to be a great leader? Are you actually a servant leader? Or might you be defined more like a dictator? Get those answers for yourself and consider putting together a group and doing Leaders for Life. Men, if you want to grow in your leadership ability and do a better job leaving a legacy, consider attending PBC's Leaders for Life Men's Conference on Saturday, September 11th from 7.30 a.m. till 12. I tell you what, come and I will buy you a steak breakfast. I tell you, these resources are going to help you live Love and lead like Jesus like never before. So I hope to see you guys on the 11th. Be blessed.